Hello viewers, this is Just Speg Network TV, a place where you can get the latest information about Nigeria news and all the news in details. Five soldiers feared dead as unknown gunmen strike again in Imo State. At least five soldiers are said to have been shot dead along Wedra Road away in Imo State as unknown gunmen attacked the area. The incident happened in the late hours of Friday. This is coming few days before the May 30th sit-at-home order given by the leader of indigenous people of Biafra, Maxi Inam Dekanu, in commemorations of the Biafran Day. According to an eyewitness, the bandits, look, the bandits took the soldiers unaware and opened fire on them, killing five at the spot. Right now, five soldiers have been shot dead. Everyone is on the run. Wedra Road, Naxi, Abba Road, Government House Roundabout, and Hardy Links Road have been shut down. I personally saw the soldiers evacuating the corpses in a Hilux vehicle. They were five. The bandits have already taken off and shot sporadically in the head to scare, to scare people away. The Himo State Police Public Relations Officer Bala Ekana's number was not reachable as at the time of filling this report. Wow, so guys, what do you think about this? What, do you, what is your own take? You know, may God help us. May God help us from these bandits. May God help us from these killings. This is getting out of hand. Can you imagine why all this incident is happening? You know, even the police cannot be reachable. Can you imagine? And we say we have police officers. We say we have armies. We say we have soldiers. What is going on in our country? Enough is enough. Federal government acted wrongly by disturbing the peace in the region in the name of forceful retaliatory supp suppressions of Biafran agitators. You know, when they have been disgraced in Sambesa forest by insurgency. May God help us. This is things is not right. You know, and we all know Biafran. Biafran, are, 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 they, they are trying to, to protect their people. All these things that they are saying, sit at home order, is just to save their people. May God help us. Things are not right in that country. Things are not right at home. Can you imagine something is happening in a whole state and then soldiers cannot be found, police cannot be found, found harmings cannot be found. Can you imagine this? May God help us. And by the end of the day, you realize that even the police and army, they are busy arresting innocent people all around. They are busy arresting innocent people, doing unnecessary things. This is uncalled for. This is uncalled for. This is not a good thing at all. And God will disgrace Nigerian military and their useless commander for doing this thing. For killing the Hebrews, for killing the innocent ones, and then supporting the Boko Haram people, full and hate all around. Because this killing is getting out of hand. You know, tomorrow you hear that this person died. The next day you hear that the, another incident happened. Government here and there, people are no more safe in the country anymore. Even to, to move around is a problem. May God help us. You know, and the Supreme Court govern, governor of Imo State assured residents that all security operators are in place to protect the people. So what happened to these soldiers now? Where are they? Where are, what, where are these soldiers? Where are these police officers? So the federal government should stop using military strength to confront these section agitators. They should stop it. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. This is not a good thing at all. This is not a good thing at all. Because the fact is that as long as soldiers and police continue to harass and kill innocent people, all in the name of PF and all in the name of IPO, or, 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 or unknown government, trust me, the killings of innocent, the killings of security men will not stop. It will not stop. God help us. People are scared of their lives. People cannot move the way they are supposed to move, you know. And then we have a governor, we have a leaders that 
that are not competent enough to, to lead us aright. And they will not tell us that they are not seeing all this thing that is happening in the country. You know, recently, a lot of things has happened in Igbo land. And here we are, we are hearing another, another thing again in Igbo state. All I can say again is that the soldiers, the police, the Hamish should do their work. And they should stop arresting innocent people. The Boko Arams are there. The, the, the Fulani headsmen are there. They cannot arrest them. They cannot even uh, uh, attack them. All they can do is just to attack the innocent people. May God help us. This is not right. They are taking this in a wrong direction. So guys, what do you think about this? What is your own take? Kindly drop your comments at the comment section below. For those who subscribe, we want to say a very big thank you to you for subscribing. We want to say God bless you. And if you're yet to do so, kindly press the subscription button below. And also, please don't forget to press the notification button so that whenever we upload news, you will always be the first person to watch our latest news. And it's a many day. God bless you for always being there for us at all time. Stay safe at this crucial time. It is very important to you, Amy. Have a lovely day once again. Bye.